How's it going everybody? Welcome back to the channel here and today's video we're going to talk about your Apple TV's remote is not working with your Apple TV. Now if you want to take control of everything about your Apple TV of course you need to use your Apple remote but if you see it's not working then you can be in trouble. Therefore in today's video we will show you how easily and simply how you can solve the problem. Now to solve the problem, the first things we're going to be telling you to do, since it's not working anymore with your Apple TV, we want you to grab your iPhone to make it work, okay? Well, now to give all the troubleshooting process for your Apple remote, the first things you have to do, you need to make your iPhone as Apple remote, okay? Now if you're going to do it, you have to just swipe down from the top, and here you need to tap on this AirPlay icon. And from here, you'll be able to find out your TV down here. Go ahead and tap in there, and here it's going to ask you for the code. Well, now go ahead and just enter your AirPlay passcode. Now afterward, you're going to be able to find out this little um, remote icon over your iPhone. Go ahead and tap on there and now you made your iPhone as a complete remote for your Apple TV. Well, once you've made your iPhone as an Apple remote, the first thing we're going to tell you to take is a charge for your Apple remote itself. Now here, just go to your settings. And from here, you have to come down to your remote and devices. And here, it's going to tell you how much battery percentage is available on your Apple remote. Well, here, if you see your battery level is down to 15% or less, then you need to charge your remote for at least 30 minutes or more in water to solve the problem. And let's say you have charged your remote for about 30 minutes and more, but nothing is working still. Well, afterward, the next things we're going to tell you to do is very simple. Just go ahead and leave your iPhone and now grab your Apple remote. Now, while you just do that, the next things you got to do, just go ahead and press and hold the menu button and that home button together. Now, go ahead and just hold them down together unless you see that your screen goes off. If you see your screen goes off, that means your remote is now being able to work properly. Now, if you see still nothing is working, your remote is not really, you know, giving you any changes. The next things they're going to tell you to do is simple. Just go ahead and just use your iPhone once again. And now on your iPhone, you got to go to your settings, okay? And once you're here, just scroll down to your remote and devices. And now scroll down here and click on learn remote. Click on there. Click on start. And here, once again, you have to grab your Apple remote. Now, while you're doing this, you have to you know, press and hold a different button to see if that uh, the blank space is filling up like that or not, okay? So if you see it's working completely fine, that means now you have no more problem available. Well, at this point of time, if you see nothing is working, that means you have problem. I mean, the hardware related problem with your Apple remote. So in that case, you need to take your Apple remote to the Apple Care. Hopefully, they will solve the problem for yourself. All right, guys. So these are the ways you guys can follow in water to solve your remote is not working with your Apple TV. And this is how you can solve it. Hope you find this video useful. If so, drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you later.